that's the hey, vlog. New Year's Eve vlog, baby. New Year's Eve vlog. We are in Bales. We've come away, as you can see from the title, for a little New Year getaway. Dan and I together in Landy. We're currently feeling a little hungry because basically we drove, we've driven to Wales, we've driven here. We got just got to the local town. All we've eaten today is mince pies and it's like two o'clock. And yes, we got to the local town, didn't we? And then we were kind of having a look around. And we were felt like a proper traditional pub. Yeah. It's like more of a fancy pub. Proper pub with like a fire. We've to this other pub that is close to our Airbnb called the Hunter's Moon, which looked so lovely. And now it's shut. So we're just feeling a bit like we're hungry, aren't we? Are you getting yeah. hungry? <laughs> yeah. So I don't know what to suggest now. Maybe we check into our Airbnb. Do you think, Dan? Yeah. Or do you think we just go back to the local town? And also we have no sync signal, so now we're a bit like we're stuck. stuck. What do we do? We could either I'm, I think I'm pretty hungry, so I've got to go, but we got to find the town back. So we just go back to the town? There was yeah. that really nice cafe. Should we just go back to that cafe? Update, but the journey was cool, wasn't it? The journey to this pub was literally, like, amazing. Land Rover Defender Drive, and it was proper thingy. Yeah. So anyway, we'll let you know how we get on, but I just thought I'd update. We found a cafe in the town. Was it good? Mm -hmm. Dan got a margarita toasting. Chips. And then I got a bagel with cheese. Chutney looks delicious. Just arrived. There's natural habitat. Looks very, very cute. Very cute. It's on a so cute. We're just walking along. What, Dan? We're just walking along a little country lane now to our little cabin in the field. It's so cute. It is a beautiful place to put it out here. You're right. No, this is actually so big, we're just saying. That's so cool, Dan. Oh my gosh. Wow. This is so cool. Oh my gosh, this is so cozy. And then a little place there to look out. Oh, cute. So cute. There's a view. Well done, Ash, you smashed it. It's even got a hob in the kitchen. Oh my god, this is Eek. so cute. This is so big, Dan. Is that wi Fi as well? Tell me how big it is. Look at that little thing. Oh, hold that, it's a good whack on it, so. Yeah, we've just got our, brought our luggage in, the bed. How sweet are these little windows, Dan? So, so you, sweet. And then for you. Put on here, so then we don't get our socks, buddy. Oh, yeah. Look how cute this is. Look, that's a table! Only if this opens to put you... Oh, cool, but then look at this. Only if this opens, yeah. Oh! Where you stuck? Oh my gosh, is that a big... Gosh, you could get another bed in there. This yeah. is under the bed. And then we were just saying there's games as well. Uno, cards, Monopoly, Connect Four. I just love the little windows. Oh, and then there's plates, kettle. I'm going to have a cup of tea. Dan's going to get the fire on. Oh. And then in here is the bathroom. Oh, that's your coat, isn't it? Shower, sink, toilet, little cupboards, and it's underfloor heating, so it's so, so, so warm. The fire's on. The fire is roaring. Lovely fire, Dan. Perfect. Gonna fill up my hot water bottle. Literally at the moment, I'm just living with a hot water bottle all the time, aren't I, Dan? Yeah. I can't believe how cute this view is. So sweet. Yeah. Maybe if it stops raining later, we can go out there, Dan, and have a little fire outside. Uh, Look out to the view. Don't ask you that. Oh, yeah, could. Oh. Is it comfy? Yeah. That's. Happy New Year, nice. Happy New Year's Eve, everyone. Do you want to play a game? Do you want to play Uno? Is Arena hit? I don't think I've ever played it before. No. I've never played it. <laughs> do you want to play it's it? It's a very commonly played game. I've not played it. I before. know. Maybe. I have to read the instructions on the back. Maybe we should play it. 
Ah, oh, also there's some tour guides. Not tour guides. Oh, a map around and about. Lake. Aw, they're so sweet. Quite an instruction. Forest of this. Dean. Oh, I went to the Forest of Dean. How's it go? I think it's near here, Dan. We could have a look at this tomorrow and go for a walk. I don't know if... Do you want to go for a walk tonight? Or shall we just get cosy place and games, have a cup of tea and then go back out and get a takeaway and then have a walk early in the morning? What do you think? Uh, what did you say again? Either walk now or walk tomorrow? Yeah. I don't know whether to get up early in the morning and just go for like a big walk. Or if you want to go... Let's have a little walk now around the ground. Yeah. <laughs> do you yeah, think... Yeah. It's getting dark. What do you think? I just said, I think it'd be nice to have a little walk around the ground. <laughs> okay, let's go for a little walk around the ground. Maybe. 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 Mayb
Happy with it. You say left this. I bet I look she looked like a blue bar for this. You look cute. Putting the wellies on in the cozy little house. I don't want to leave this cabin. So warm in here. We just ordered it. Oh, that's our muddy boots. Oh, sorry. I've just ordered it. Hopefully that'll keep going, ready for when we get back. Nice little Indian. Nice little coolie. And then we're going to go tomorrow. So we go pick up the Indian, get some wine. Yeah. And we'll be back. Do you want to have bacon butties in the morning? Maybe. Let's see how we feel. Yeah. yeah. Serving for breakfast, I think, yeah. would be nice. Yeah. Wish us luck. We're going outside in the cold. Oh my gosh, we just got back to the cabin. We just got the takeaway. And guess how hot it is in here? 40 degrees. I just picked up the plate and it honestly feels like they've been yeah, preheated in the oven. In the oven. <laughs> so we've got a takeaway, we've got Indian takeaway, we've got some bread rolls and some bacon for the morning, some orange juice, some red wine. Oh, We're having a little yeah. party in here, aren't we? I'm just going to get the takeaway out. I think it's so hot. I honestly can't believe these plates are just so, so hot. Like, they've been preheated. Um, I love the little bits. Maybe. playing this monopoly it's a really good game actually it's, it's actually um really good. monopoly deal breaker it's called it's actually so um good. and then it's literally you're basically collecting money and then property sets and then there's action cards to, and you got to collect three full property sets so alice has got two and i've got it's one and a half really, it's fun it is very fun we've played like quite a few games for you know and it's fun down to reach my house I really don't. On um, Uno, but not this. Yeah. I nearly thought I'd done it, but then I haven't. But I'm very close to winning, <laughs> so. Mm. Watch your space. <laughs> just to let everybody know, I've just won two games from Monopoly. <laughs> and, um, Twice. Two out of two. <laughs> two out of two. These cards are mine. <laughs> <laughs> she absolutely smashed it. Both times she just like, oh, you monkey. Sorry. I shouldn't place them all down like I did. Sorry to be a winner. All you have to do is just take one of each and you won. That is crazy. I know. Got a good technique going. Bet winner plays. Yeah, we'll plays. do another one, yeah. yeah Woohoo! You know why I'm glad? Can you believe this? At the start of Monopoly, Dan was reading out the instructions and said, no, I didn't. This looks no, complicated. I, didn't. I don't think you'll, be, you'll get it. I did not. Sorry. And I have won four. I guess how many games we've played? Four. I guess how many have won? Four. I yeah, guess how many Dan's won? Zero. Literally, I just played Uno, beat a five to one. Yeah, And then we started playing Bloody Monopoly, which is <laughs> smashing me every game. <laughs> I need to go all this back, guys. This is getting bad. <gasps> oh, <I love> that. <laughs> it's actually super fun, isn't it? Yeah, it's a good game. It's clever because mm. um, it's a quick way of playing because it's cards. Yeah. And then you've got like a bank, and then every card could be worth something. Mm. And it's like just quick switching and swapping, and like all you need is sets, not bankrupt each other. So it doesn't matter if you're super rich or not, if they got three sets, you've won. That's what's good. Yeah, I think you can either go after the money or the property. Last game, I literally went after both. I had loads of money and loads of property. I know what else. Just a pro, you know. <laughs> Not gonna lie, it's so hot in here. 23 degrees. It's, it's cooling. It's cooling down. Should, are you okay with the fire being off then? Yeah. Oh, so it's super, super windy in here. Yeah, like. it's super windy tonight. We keep joking around that the trailer will just start rolling away <laughs> or tip over. What would you actually do if it's like rolling down the hill? Nothing, just hope for the best. Would you, you wouldn't hop out if it started rolling? Yeah, I probably would try. I would hop out, but then also at the same time, we'll actually have pyjamas. Sure, think how high we are. Why? How high those steps are if we did have to hop out. Yeah. 
be a big jam. And also... I, do you know what's funny? What? I just watched the new Grand Tour episodes, Gandhi Flick, which is a, uh, when they went to Norway. And they dragged caravans on the back of their Did they? cars. Yeah. I know, what are you going to find? I was just going to say, if we did hop out, we'd literally be like, it's mud out there in our pyjamas in the winds. We'd be covered in our PJs. Gorgeous. The fire is on, the bats are getting warmed, and the bacon is frying. Sat in bed having a cup of tea, looking out to this. And Dan was just saying that last time. I had a dream, Dad. <laughs> he was having a dream because the storm was so bad. And what were you thinking, Dan? I was basically saying that because I was dreaming that. It was so bad that the owner was getting really nervous. <laughs> Do you want your hair like that on camera? Don't mind. Okay. He was getting really nervous. And then um, one of the... Because I kept seeing like little white lights. So I thought that there were sparks coming from the uh, electricity pole. Uh... So then I thought that it, was, it came on top of us. And then the guy was like, oh, it's a bit dangerous. I'm really worried. And then he was like, Do you, okay, we need to pack up so you can pack up now. Yeah. And we'll give you half the money back. <laughs> because we don't want to pack up on New Year's Eve. Or if you wait till tomorrow morning, oh we, but we need to empty the whole cabin because I'm scared about it. But it's been blown over. And then he even said stuff like, um, "Oh, we've never seen the cabin, but in this windy before, so we're really nervous." So yeah, can you pack up the whole cabin? Don't have a shower. Don't do anything. Pack it up and do it oh the night for free. Bacon, burp in the morning. Just what you want. That looks a nice roll. The sun's rising now. You can see it through there. It's so beautiful. We're up and we're about. We're just finished off it getting ready. It's feeling fresh. It's a beautiful day, isn't it, Dan? It's a beautiful day. The sun is shining. And we're ready to attack the first day of the new year. Aren't we, Dan? Sure. This cabin has been such a cute little stay. It's been so good. We're just discussing like what we want to, where we want to go today. But I'm thinking, we're just discussing like what and how we do with our first day three. Yeah, what we do on the first day of the year and and the twenty two season. There is and the twenty twenty two season. Oh yeah, that trending reel that's everywhere. Oh, the twenty twenty two season. Twenty twenty two season has come to an end. Well, no longer 2022 now, is it? Yeah, so what we think we might do, I went on the Kaput app, I don't know if you know it, it's a really good one, isn't it, Dan? But I literally just put Kaput. the Kaput. It, yeah. It's basically just the, you put in wherever you want and then it gives you just like routes to go walking. And I put in this precise location and there was only two walks. And they were like five um, five hours or four hours. So we thought that was probably a bit too long, wasn't it? So what we're going to do is we're going to drive to, I don't know if you can see it over there, that mountain there. We're going to drive to there and then climb it. And I think it's only like two hours or something, two, three hours. Two which, hours after, the whole walk, I think. Yeah. So we think that's probably about right have a little drive can't we damn see that get some fresh air we haven't been climbing well not climbing but we haven't been hiking in a while so i'm excited Sad to leave this cabin it would be sweet to have another night wouldn't it but yeah. you can fit actually so much in just when you come for like one night can't you really to be honest well, on the road we go and guys my motto who cares if it rains <laughs> it's not actually my motto, but... To be yeah. honest, it's not raining today, it's so nice, and... I'd rather it not. I'd rather it not rain, but... Anyway, here we go. Just 
just going to show you the views on it's nice day look blue skies blue skies and yeah that is the mountain there that one that's there so we're going to climb today